In this video, we're going to learn about working with precision in Designer. Direct modeling excels at being able to create and modify geometry quickly, but this does not come at the cost of working with precision, where we have a number of ways to ensure we can create high quality CAD for manufacturing. Let's take a closer look. Open caselid.vdf. Let's look at the grill feature here. If we wanted to continue repeating this feature along the part, we would need to ensure the size and the spacing of the slots were kept consistent. From the Solids tab, select Translate Feature. Select the four faces of one of the slots. There are a number of ways we can copy this feature along the part, but let's take a look at an incremental method. We'll make a multiple copy so we can clearly see the results in the preview. Using the measurement menu, we can see a list of tools that can be used to ensure accuracy. It is worth spending some time getting to know each of these, but for now, we'll select the Y distance. To use this measurement type, you select a reference point and a destination point. This is quite similar to the point-to-point -point translation mode, except for being constrained in the y-axis only. The origin of the slider is important in using Designer precisely. Using the Alt button on your keyboard and holding down the left mouse button, you can drag the origin of the slider to snap to useful locations. This can be particularly useful for translating and rotating features and geometry. You can see how useful this is if you want to rotate this feature. We could use the rotate feature command for this, but it's also possible in the translate feature command. Window select the feature, hold down Alt and move the origin to snap to a rotation point. Enter the angle you want to rotate the feature and apply the command. The ruler tool is also useful for precise measurements of arcs and cylindrical geometries. For example, we can easily match blends to the arc of other geometry. Select Create Blends and choose an edge. From the measurement menu, choose the segment length or circle arc radius. Choose the feature you want to match and right-click to accept. At the moment, we have seen how simple geometry data is used in Designer for creating precise CAD. But Designer has precision manufacturing at its heart, and so many years of experience in CNC manufacturing is fully embedded in the elements of the software. Let's finish by seeing how manufacturing data is put to work for precision unfolding of this sheet metal part. From the Sheet Metal tab, choose Set Part Properties. We have the choice for being able to unfold the part based on the CAD information alone, or the design parameter. But for the most accurate results, it is best to use the bending data directly from the output of the tools and machines available for manufacture. So here, you will see access to the SFX database can enable live data for increased precision. Even without linking to a live database, if we choose the tool-based result, we can unfold the part based on the V-width which we have available for manufacture. Right-click to apply this and then use the toggle view to see the developed sheet. Using the 3D measuring tool, we can verify the dimensions of our part blank 
which would be needed for precise manufacturing on the different tools available.